don't want to see the banjo, but like we don't want to screw anybody over by making them play a character that they had a um, super unfamiliar time against. But uh, we're going to see the banjo ditto. So those of you still on stream are rewarded for your patience. <laughs> With a pretty sweet banjo ditto here. Let's see. And how on banjo this stage, goes. which they all. Oh, it's the FD version of it. So we're chilling. We're chilling. Egg. Yeah, egg. Egg. Yeah, egg I'm still not real. entirely sure how those eggs work. They just bounce so, like, unpredictably. And the side B catching the uh, whiffed attack there. Banjo skins are bad. Banjo skin. Some of them are okay. Some of them are not. Nice down throw to uh, Ford Smash right there coming out of Oreo. Mm. Catches the recovery with the down smash there. Noise. Nice up smash, sort of, but it didn't hit. It, it happens. We're seeing some up airs. We're seeing some, uh... Y'all, Banjo came out yesterday. Yeah, I've got to commentate a character that came out yesterday. The side right. is kind of sick. You get, like, five of them per stock, I think. Yeah, it reminds me. It is, and I don't think it recharges. It's a lot like Charizard's Flare Blitz, but sometimes it's, I feel like it comes out even faster and it's even uh, harder to predict. Fun fact, um, Banjo-Kazooie's side B will actually... Um, it will take priority over Charizard's Flare Blitz, according to at least one Twitter post. Okay. So okay. if you throw it out against Charizard's Flare Blitz... Um, yeah. I have absolutely no doubt that five minutes after patch 5.0 dropped, people are like, let's do side B versus Flare Blitz right now and see what happens. Yeah, basically. It's the kind of science and uh, experimentation the Smash community is known for. Absolutely. Ooh, Ooh. there it is again, punishing Ooh. the charge Ooh. there, trying to read the get up roll, but side, side B them into oblivion. Go. Uh -huh. Gosh, I kind of feel bad for Kazooie with those Smash attacks. Okay. Just getting slammed into the ground like that. Banjo Saibi is fully invincible unless you grab them out of it. What? Oh, there it is again. That's a little busted. Yeah, I mean, your best bet the, is just uh, to shield and just kind of try to punch it with a dash attack when it goes by you. Or just jump if possible. Or, I don't yeah, know. Or just jump. Just that, jump that and too. figure out where they're going to land. Or I like me, know. you just whiff an attack in the middle of the stage and then get crushed. I mean... Have a down throw oh, down throw smash. into forward smash. Could That's mash not out of it true. Fast but, you know, when you're at like 130, you can't mash out of it. It's basically true enough, so it, it happens. You can banjo side B through magic burst. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? So I think it would be super sad if you uh, banjo Kazooie side B right into a kamikaze. That's just a sad hero <laughs> right there. Oh, man. It goes through everything. The only thing that stops it is grabs. Man, Banjo side be busted. The good thing is not a lot else about him is, I mean, the Nair's kind of nice and looks a little bit disjointed. The forward smash is very strong and has a pretty decent amount of knockback. But uh, he's, his recovery, like, can very easily be exploited, I feel like. Yeah, it kind of sticks you above that stage just down, enough that any... The down throw to forward smash, not a lot. I feel like he can't really get a whole bunch off of throws. But if somebody can prove me wrong, so be it. I'm sure I'll be proven wrong eventually. Yeah, he has that kind of berry throw, which uh, has been used to oh, great yeah. effect in this game. But yeah. um, I think players are going to be able to adapt to it eventually. Definitely. I thought Banjo was banned tonight. Okay, so boys, what happened was Banjo was not technically banned. It was a thing of we decided to throw in a gentleman's clause for Banjo as in as long as both players agree to Banjo <laughs> being side allowed during the B. game, we will allow it. So if both players agree on Banjo being allowed, it's allowed, but both players have to agree. Otherwise, Banjo is not allowed tonight because he is very new. Oh. Nice up smash to finish off that game right there. I want to see both However, Banjo players stand on either side of the stage and just side B into each other and just there's going to be a cataclysmic explosion that would result. Obviously. Right, there, there has yes, to be. Yes, yes. But, uh, so basically, Oreo and Wizard Guy both agreed, let's Banjo ditto for the fun of it on Banjo stage. So, um, that's what happened. Like fair and balanced there. character. Okay, Banjo actually, for the most part, is kind of fair and balanced besides the side B. But having one busted move doesn't make a character unfair for the most part, really. Yeah, like, once, I think... People play him enough and get used to him. They'll start getting, like, yeah. for a while, like, Charizard's Flare Blitz, or Flare Blitz can get people out of, or take them by surprise and catch people. But oh, I yeah. think people are mostly. There's definitely going to be some now. counterplay to it. For sure. Like, people will adapt. Yeah. He is fair on being serious. Yeah. He actually, yeah, he is very, he's actually pretty fair. Down throw to side B is busted. Ooh, that could be. Ooh. They're both trying <laughs> to like grab. triple spot dodge there. They're just Those dancing. Spot dodges. They <laughs> dance and dancing. <laughs> But finally, the jab was able to break the neutral gridlock there. Oh, he tries Ooh, to uh, punish the lack of attack with the side B. But 
this Couldn't quite get it. Dodge. Is there? Oh. Ooh. Oh. Oh, trying to gimp that recovery with eggs. I mean, I think getting gimped by a banjo egg is, is one of the saddest moments I've, uh, I've had so far. Yeah. I mean, as a cloud player, I get gimped by pretty much everything, but <laughs> the egg feels even worse. Oh, with the reading of the spot dodge there. Very well done. Punishing, Punishing it with, with a forward smash. smash. Nice, nice. Trying to do it again, but this time with your guy getting around it. Mashing out of down throw is so easy. It really oh. is. Punishes the whip with the down air there. Yeah, so Banjo's down air actually isn't too bad. It's actually pretty good. Oh, Ooh, uh, nice it's a fair punch. Off stage. It's a big old punch. Very nice. Because I don't know what the actual Seems word Seems pretty for similar it. to Ganondorf's fair. Just kind of a nice knuckle to the face. Yeah. Or kind of just Mario's fair, but like without the spike hitbox. Mm. Too true. Oh, with the side, side B, B into side into B. Into side B. Taking advantage of the end lag there with the side <laughs> B of his own. I think we're going to see quite a bit of side Bs keep coming out from these Banjo players until people know what to do against it. I, I, I can't fair. imagine. That's That's got to be very satisfying. It to is land. Doc Fair. Aw, you're so right, Boom. Why'd you have to say it? Why'd you have to say it? Why'd you have to remind me Dr. Mario exists in this game? He's not good. I guess that's Yo, a fair point. Yo, look at point. that zombie carved into the wall. What zombie carved into the wall? What do you mean? I guess it's somewhere in the background. Ooh, nice the side parry on that to side B. Trying to grab him after that, we see from Oreo. Down, throw, forward, yeah, smash. Still trying to figure but out it's how to, still uh, pretty easy to mash out of. Still trying to figure out how to optimally play into that down throw. Like, I wonder if an there? up smash afterwards would actually be sort of the optimal play sometimes. Because if they start mashing out of it, the up smash might be able to catch if it does have a big enough hitbox. Yeah. So, like, I know that's the thing with Villager. Oh, it drops the shield it's right nice. at the last second and eating that side B for the stock. Nice spot, dodge, grab. Let's see if Oreo. <laughs> Trying to read it, but reads it the wrong way. Wizard guy just kind of backing yeah, I, up I, and waiting. I respect the attempt. I mean, side B reads are pretty fantastic. <laughs> I appreciate watching this. Ooh, nice oh. side B again right there by Wizard Guy. It comes out guy. so quickly, I'm telling and you. And it's like, very strong, too. One whiff attack, and that's all it takes to get punished by those side <laughs> They're both trying to go deep for it. <laughs> Ooh, Wizard Guy almost not making it back, because uh, Banjo's recovery, not great. His jumps are not very high up, which is very notable weakness of Banjo. Oh, Ooh. there it is. You get hit by side a side B, B, side B, and you don't expect it they coming back. They just are trading side <laughs> Bs right now, and it's, it's good. It's really good. Yeah, still not quite sure how to edge guard with Banjo yet. Um, I feel like his grenades could definitely be good in edge guarding those down B grenades. The eggs obviously are good at also edge guarding them if they're pretty far off stage. Um, it's just getting the angles that are tricky at this point. And then you could also try daring, but the problem is there's a pretty good risk involved because Banjo does not have a great recovery. So if you miss the dare, you might die for it. Or they might reverse the edge guard situation completely. Nice up smash right there. Yeah, these side Bs are coming out quick and fast just because they're so hard to punish. And that up smash will actually there take it. it is. All right. Oreo 2-0 over Wizard Guy in the first Banjo play we have seen tonight. The first Banjo set is in the books. And it is a Banjo Ditto 